Hey, welcome to Mira's math class. Yes. Now, my dear children, we are going to see the word problems of time chapter. Now, um, as I told you, there are two types of times which I say. One is exact time and the other is duration. Now, first, you have to read the word problems and you have to write which one is the time and which one is the duration. First thing, you are going to do that. Let's see the first example. A film show starts at 8.30 p.m. So, this is the starting time. Okay, You can write even that this is starting time. Okay, S.T. for shortcut to understand. It lasts for 2 hours 20 minutes. Now underline this what it is. This is duration. Let's write it as D. At what time does it end? Now you see what it is asked. These two are given and this is asked. And what is asked? The end time is asked. Understood? This is the way we can go for the other questions. Uh, I'll read one more question to make you understand. Mr. Raj leaves for office at 7.45 a. That means starting time. Right? ST. Underline and write it. ST. You can write it on the top or below. That doesn't matter. He reaches there after 1 hour 10 minutes. That is duration. At what time? Did he reach there? That means which time it is asked? This is end time. Okay. So, now let's do these two questions first. Where starting time is given and duration is given. And end time is asked. Okay. So, here you see how to write. Starting time of film show is equal to 8.30 p.m. Now, what is the duration the movie runs for or the film show runs for? Duration is equal to 2 hours and 20 minutes. Now, here starting time is given. Duration is given. What you are going to do? You are going to find out the end time or you can write ending time. When it is ending time of film show is equal to what you are going to do here, you are going to add it. Okay, so let's add it 0 plus 0, 0, 3 plus 2 is 5, 8 plus 2 is 10. Now, what will you do here? Don't write hours and minutes. This is ending time, it will be am or pm. Remember that. So, 10, 50, here PM is given, so 8 to 10, there is no 12 o'clock, I mean 12 number in between, so you will write 10, 30, 10, 50 PM. Now, similarly for B number, let's write, so now, you see, starting time for office is 7.45 AM. Then comes duration. 1 hour 10 minutes. After completing the distance, when he is reaching the office, what will be the time? Therefore, this I forgot to tell you to put that therefore here. You put therefore ending time of film show is 10.50 p.m. Now, therefore... Ending time okay, is equal to, you have to add 5, 4 plus 1, 5, 7 plus 1, 8. So, 855A. You can write after this, you can write a sentence even. So, he reaches at 8.55 a.m. 
okay here also you can write so the film show ends at 10 50 pm you can write or this much is also enough okay okay now the next example that is c number sheila studies hindi for 1 hour 40 minutes and mathematics for 2 hours 15 minutes see i underlined 1 hour 40 minutes what is this this is duration mathematics for 2 hours 15 minutes that is duration so here two durations are given durations of time is given how long so how long does she study so what is asked how long how long means it is asked for duration two duration times are given now if you add it you will get the duration okay we will see how to write it children leave two lines and then write c number okay now what you are going to do is write first is duration of duration of time Sheila studies duration of time Sheila studies Hindi first is Hindi you can put two dots that is colon Hindi how much one hour and 40 minutes then mathematics duration of time Sheila studies mathematics is 2 hours 15 sorry it's 15 this is 15 and so 15 minutes now therefore total duration is equal to we will calculate the total time 5 4 plus 1 5 1 plus 2 3 now here hours are given here minutes are given here it is 3 hours and 55 minutes you can write so Sheila studies for 3 hours 55 minutes okay easy now children let's go to the next question that is d number my mother went for shopping at 10 10 a.m she returned at 11 55 a.m for how long did she do shopping here two durations were given we found out the duration this is how long that is duration we found out here you see another type of question is this is went for shopping at 10 10 a.m. that means this is starting time then she returned at 11 55 a.m. that means ending time it is given now for how long did she do shopping this is one starting point and ending point is given you have to find the duration here two durations you added and you found duration here from starting point and ending point you have to find out the duration so what we are going to do let's see how to write it now this is the way to write remember if uh, when there uh, two starting time and ending time is given and duration it is asked you have to subtract now you will subtract the ending time i mean you will write the ending time first then starting time 
then you will subtract starting time from the ending time then you will get the duration so how i wrote you see ending time of shopping is equal to 11:55 am starting time of shopping is equal to 10:10 10, 10 am then you subtract it therefore duration you will be finding out the duration and how to find out 5 minus 0 5 5 minus 1 4 then 1 minus 0 is 1 1 minus 1 is 0 so 1 hour this is duration remember 1 hour 45 minutes don't write am or pm okay so what is the question how long did she do shopping therefore or you can read so mother my mother did shopping for 1 hour 45 minutes. Okay.